So I finally made it back out here in the range. Uh, we've got a storm coming in, wind, snow, rain, ice, all that good stuff. Before that starts, I'm <coughs> getting over to sign this thing, maybe. Uh, I just brought out the old 10 millimeter. I wanted to try to catch extreme penetrators, so I got uh, eight gallons of water. I better do it. <clears throat> and then it's brought out the good old duck town. So uh, I'm just gonna do a couple little shooting things. See what see what the duck town can do, and then uh, see what this extreme. See if we can catch extreme penetrator. All right. So this is extreme penetrator by Underwood Ammo. It is uh, 140 grain solid copper, 1500 feet a second, and we're shooting out the old uh, Glock 40 here, the G40. Let's see what we can do here. Point blank. Oh. Okay, so I tell you what. Uh, point blank. Uh, when you're sick, in the cold, in the wind, was <coughs> less than ideal. Oh my God, did I get soaked? So she decided. I think we might have caught it. Where'd that one go? Let's put up the handle, maybe. She started deviating towards. There she is. Oh, nice! It's perfect. Look at that thing. That is so perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Oh man, that is absolutely perfect. The only thing you can see is the rifling. That is so cool, man. Completely undamaged. I like that. Yeah, let's see what the duck tom can do. Alright, so this is this is a good old duck town. It's a double barrel 410. There's two three-inch 410 mag <laughs> three-inch magnums in there. And with this gun, you gotta take the safety off. If you put the selector right in the middle, you can actually shoot both barrels. Oh, and it sucks to do, so point blank. Ah. Okay, so yeah, you got to get just right on there. I'll try again. Here's just a regular one. All right, I got to try to shoot both barrels here. You just got to get the selector just in the right spot. It's been forever since I shot this. So use your three inch 410 Magnums, three inch 410s, I guess, whatever. High brass, so. And then. I will keep trying. Look a little close to this metal. I don't know. Hide behind you guys. Okay, see if I shot both. Yeah, nope. See, you only shot the right. We gotta get just perfect. And if you have one of these duck towns, don't ever let the hammer down when you close it. It'll go off. It won't be good for anybody. Let's try to range down there. <laughs> I'll keep trying. I couldn't get both barrels of fire. I think it's just because of the new ammo. It's federal ammo. The older stuff, I could always get both of fire. And one BB came back and hit me in the face, and I'm bleeding now. So I said, fuck that. I'm done. So let's see what uh, kind of spurt it has at way too close. I mean, this thing is incredible. But, yeah, hopefully get out and do some more videos soon. And until then, see you next time. Okay, uh, my buddy Mrs. Mail had a little challenge he did where he took his pocket knife in a real nice spider co and you gotta try to cut the paper towel roll without it you know stand it's just slightly wedged in there his only mistake was is he didn't use a gold knife as we know gold makes everything better so let's see what a gold knife can do to the paper towel all right you ready one two told you gold makes everything better <laughs>